Before we get started, I want to thank Skillshare for sponsoring today's video. Over here at Kevin Stage Studios, we love Skillshare. We appreciate them for partnering with us as much as they have. Um, so shout out to you guys. If you're unfamiliar with Skillshare, they are a online platform for creatives. So whether you're at the beginning of your creative journey, the middle of your creative journey, or even if you feel like you're an expert, I assure you there's a class for you on Skillshare. And I say that because they have, no matter where you are, what you're doing, whether you're in photography or blogging or YouTube or cooking they have tons and tons of classes taught from a variety of people um, that look different have varying levels of expertise so you're always able to get and learn something new I recently took a class titled YouTube success with youtuber podcast and tech head Marquise Brown Lee fantastic class he teaches you everything from starting your next project to researching your topics writing your script, planning your visuals, all types of information that you're going to need in order to make your YouTube channel successful. And since that's where I'm currently at in my journey, that's what I put in. You simply go into the search bar, whatever it is that you're interested in, type it in and a host of classes will pop up and you get to decide who you want to, um, which class you want to take. If you're interested, you can sign up right now using the link in my description box where you can sign up and the first 1,000 people to use the link will receive a free trial of Skillshare Premium. After that, an annual subscription is less than $10 per month. That's right, less than $10 per month. I know you spend less more than $10 per month one outing at a fast food joint one okay this is ad free constantly updated content that you'll have access to for a year for less than ten dollars per month with an annual subscription click the link be part of the first 1000 thank you skillshare for sponsoring today's video let's get started on this haul girl i'm excited you hear me hey i never did that before huh 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 hello everybody welcome back to my channel i am miss kev on stage and i'm gonna do something different today i am trying to get into like fashion i love clothes um even though i'm dressing like plain as jane today that's okay uh kevin and i are going on a little mini vacation for his birthday to cabo and so what i wanted to do was i bought like a bunch of clothes from shein j lux pretty little thing and i wanted to do like a try on haul with you guys so here are all the items that i bought and we'll just like you know go one by one figure out what i like what i don't like what i want to put on you know do the things so let's get started all right Okay, so the first thing that I have is this little blazer. It's actually from Just Fab. Um, it's double-breasted, which is not what I thought. The idea is to wear this blazer with some shorts and maybe like a little crop top. It's kind of the vibes that I'm going for, you know, maybe a little heel, a little shoe, a little hat. Very like vacation vibes. So I'm gonna put the little outfit together and I'll come back and show you guys and, you know, let me know what you think. Okay, so these are kind of the vibes, of course. Everything that I own is kind of too big. My waist is kind of really small. So, but I kind of like these the way that they are, right? Like, I know I kind of feel like this is kind of cute. And then the idea would be to put on this blazer. So maybe I should put on like a different colored shirt. Oh yeah, no, this is a no. I think it's the shirt. Like, am I giving, am I giving vacation? I don't feel like it's giving what it needs to give. I kind of like it better without the blazer. Okay, so this is it without the blazer. And I kind of feel like this is a better vibe with the sunglasses. Yeah, I'm kind of liking this better. I feel like this is very like, effortless vacation I kind of wish these shorts were a little tighter maybe like this so they actually look like they fit but yeah so this is outfit number one this shirt is from jlux it's uh, on sale actually I'll leave a link to it in the description box but it's from jlux I think I got these sunglasses from like forever 21 I just like the big frame on them you know throw on some gold accessories maybe not this but just uh, this here some shorts I have wedges on I don't know, I feel like I'm serving vacation. Okay, so the next outfit is this little number. I got it from Pretty Little Thing. It's just, I don't know, it's definitely serving 
vacation resort vibes. I really just thought it was super cute. It comes with this shirt. And then I also got the matching pants. You guys, I was doing the most, I already know. But like, I really am into like matching sets right now. So it comes with these matching bottoms, which again, it may be too much, but I'm gonna try them on anyway. And then like with this, and then with this bikini that also matches. So the it's very light material, it's definitely vacation vibes. Um, you know, Pretty Little Thing is not very expensive at all. And I just feel like it would be super cute. My assumption is that I'm going to have to hem it because with most, th most things with me, I have to either take them in at the waist or hem them because um, I have a short or a small waist and I'm short. So I'm gonna try this on. I'll try it on with the bikini top so you can see it like open. And with this, again, not very expensive. So I got the whole set and we'll see how it looks. I'm not gonna lie. I love this. It is maybe a little long, but I still have the wedges on, so it's giving me some height, which is uh, making it not drag on the floor. A little big in the waist, but not too bad. And the idea of this is like totally giving me vacation vibes. It's giving me resort vibes. It's very, very like, very light material, like super, super light material. You're not gonna get too hot. If you're going to the beach or if you're going to the pool for a day, like, I don't know. I feel like this is giving my credit score is 850. I feel like it's giving. I mean, I drive with the top down. Like, I feel like this is giving. I've worked so hard through the week and through the month and through the year that, like, I deserve to be here. And what my belly button y'all is not quite an any it's not quite an Audi I don't know I've had it my whole life and kids didn't help and then I at one point had a belly button piercing so that's what you see here I'm just gonna address the obvious but outside of that like I like this what do you guys think is it cute is it too much I feel like it's giving oh what if I tied it right yeah I feel like that's cute you like tie it a little bit I didn't button this Riley, let me grab the sunglasses. Like, I feel like this is giving, I'm on vacation, pass me the margarita, pass me the pina colada, like I'm having a good time. Oh, there's no pockets. Ah, oh, bum. There's no pockets. <sighs> okay, so this is the shirt dress on. Uh, this belt is not the belt that I would want to wear with this, but I feel like it would be really cute with the belt to kind of, you know, give you some shape a little bit. Um, but this is it without the belt. I think I like it. I really do. It is like exactly what I would imagine, which is really super easy, simple to kind of put on, throw on. I'm leaving these wedges on. Like, that's just what it is. I'm leaving the wedges on. But you don't have to wear like wedges. You can wear whatever you want, but I'm not mad at this. Like, I feel like this is very simple summer wear. You know, it's very light material. It's not very heavy. So you could definitely wear it in the summer. I'm always cold, so the idea of long sleeve is always appealing. Throw on your shades. And I just feel like, like I'm living. Like, I know I look, you know, my makeup's not done or whatever, but like, you still can't at me. Like, I just feel like I'm still giving what needs to be gave. You know what I mean? I mean, is that a thigh? Is that a thigh? Is that a thigh? I feel like that might be a thigh. Okay, so that's this outfit. Really, really like it. We're gonna move on to, let's go to, let's go to a few dresses. So I got this dress from, again, Pretty Little Thing. Really, really cute. Um, the material's a little thicker than I thought, but it's not very heavy. Just a nice spaghetti strap, you know, I would call this like midi, midi length. I really like this dress. I'm really excited to try it on. I think it's gonna be, again, super cute to be on vacation. Very easy to put on, you know, not a lot of work, very effortless, but at the same time, it looks like you tried hard. Okay, so this is the dress on. It's definitely hugging. I'm not a very curvy person. So it's, it's hugging and if you have cur curves, it's going to definitely like accentuate those curves. I have to like sit in a hit that's non-existent in order to create a curve, but this dress is very sexy. I'm gonna take these um, 
I'm gonna take them off because they're distracting from the cuteness of this outfit. I feel like this is going to do and give exactly what it needs to do. Simple, easy date night on the town with you and your boo, you and your girl, or vacation vibes. Like, I love a good animal print anyways. It just does something for me. But like, yeah, this is super cute. I, I love this. Two thumbs up for me. Okay, so this is the next outfit from Shein. told me to buy this who, who told me to buy this I can't imagine or I can't remember how the model looked in this but nothing first of all nothing about this nothing about this is nothing about this is me that's what I'm trying to tell you nothing about this is me like it is first of all First of all, is the booty booty? Like I feel like maybe the booty is booty. Huh? Let me, let me, just play. I feel like this is a strong, what the heck were you thinking when you bought this? I feel like this is giving, don't fly too close to the sun. Oop, too late you did. I feel like these shorts are not for me. It's like, oddly cut like I feel like this should actually be a little bit tighter here this whole color scheme is a no for me the I actually whoever stitched this I actually want them to turn in their like sewership license and never stitch anything again because this is such a like why would I think that this would look good on my body help me help me help all right so i'm back with this dress and i love this dress there are no pockets i thought they were with this little dip right here definitely thought those were pockets they are not uh it hugs just right it's actually giving me the illusion of hips here uh see that just you know you know, is that a hip girl? I think it is. So it's giving me the illusion of hips, which I love. It is, I don't know why it's gathering here, but I almost feel like it looks like the booty is booty. Um, I think that this is so cute. Yeah, I really do. I think that this is just really simple, really easy, easy to do when you're on vacation. It's not, you know, giving too much, slap it on, throw on your makeup, your jewelry, whatever, and it feels a lot more elevated than the amount of effort it took to get there. Does that make sense? That's all I'm about. Like, the amount of effort it took to make this look like I did a lot, minimal. But when I step out, it's like, oh girl, you kinda did that, right? Like, I feel like it's so cute. Tell me this isn't giving vacation. You know what I mean? Like, this is giving, this is giving vacation. I'll, find, I'll try to find the link to this purse too because it's the epitome of vacation. I'm going out to a nice dinner. I'm going out to a nice lunch. Perfect for even like a brunch during the summer. Like I love this dress. I actually really love this dress as you can tell. So we're gonna go into one more thing, a little bit more casual. Uh, that is this top here. It is a crop top, which again, isn't always my favorite, but in my mind, throwing some like Bermuda shorts, jewelry, earrings, you know, your accessories always like dress up or dress down an outfit. And in my mind, this top is versatile that way. Okay, so this is the last outfit. I just put on those same shorts from earlier, which again, they are too big, which is very common for me. I have to get them like taken in, but assuming that they're like taken in here, this is very simple, very easy. I'm not a, too much of a shorts girl. I like to look aged down too much, but this is like really cute. I feel like this mint green is going to be like the color of the summer. I see it like everywhere. Um, so I got a couple shirts this color. I think it's so pretty against my skin tone, love. Even the way my jewelry is set right now, I actually really love. Throw on some bangles if you want. Um, you can throw on some flats. 
really cute some flat sandals if you want to dress it up you could do some nice heels but i just feel like this is also really cute i'm gonna try to put on over that white blazer to see if it's gonna give that look i was going for earlier let's see i don't know what i what type of blazer i need to get to get this outfit maybe it's because this is double breasted I don't know, but I'm totally looking for like, this is the vibe of the outfit that I'm looking for that you can totally like dress up. Okay, let's try take this off. Cause this isn't giving honey. This is giving very like formal. I think this is better. Like imagine this not being here. Okay, this is like a, a lot of imagining, right? But I think I could pull this off. I think if I could find this blazer, long sleeve, no cuff, or at least no cuff with the leopard print here, animal print. Did I not bend these pants up? Also, maybe if this wasn't so ruffly here, if it was just like a straight bandage top, but I'm actually kind of liking this vibe a little bit more. I'm gonna throw on some heels so you can see like the whole vibe. Okay, so I threw on a pair of like just open toe sandals. I think that this is like low key, kind of the vibes. Low key, I don't hate it with this now. I kind of feel like it's a, it's a choice, but I feel like I could rock it. I don't know, what are your thoughts? I also threw on just like a flat sandal if I wanted just to kind of calm it down, but I feel like the blazer dresses this up unintentionally. So I feel like this becomes the vibe. Like, I feel like this is a vibe. Sometimes what helps too is throwing on like pairing your accessories. I don't know why I can't get this to do what I wanted to do. Yeah, you guys, I think this is it. Like at first I was like no to this pattern cuff, but like low key now I think I love it. <laughs> and I put these sunglasses on and I think it's giving what I want it to give. Like this is a moment, okay? This is a moment, I think I love this. My answer is yes. Maybe not tens, but it's definitely giving me like 8.5, okay? Let me know what you think. Flat, this, should I get the long sleeve without the pattern? Should I leave it as is? Let me know. Okay, so the very last outfit I'm going to try is this blazer dress. I love blazer dresses on people. I think they're so freaking cute. I've been trying to find one that I think will fit my body. This might have to be taken in from what I'm looking at, but this, this double breastedness here, I just love this. I really, really do. So I'm going to try this on, let you guys know my thoughts, and then this will be the last video or the last situation, I promise. So this is the blazer dress. Overall, Overall, I think I do love this. I love the idea of it. I do obviously have to get this like kind of taken in a bit here um, to fit the way I think they should fit. Maybe close this up just a hair or I don't know if you wear bandage tops underneath here. I'm not quite sure, but throw on a pair of heels here. Oh, it's a little short and big, but throw on a pair of heels, your accessories, and I think that this is a go. I truly love the idea of this. I really, really do. It's super cute, super fun. I've never had a blazer dress before. And um, even the way that this is low here, it's almost like asymmetrical, I love. This is double lined, which I also love. So it's not like see-through in the back, which is really great. Um, I love the like gold accessories here, the gold buttons here I think is really great. I love this. I really do. I really, really, really do. Throw on those heels I had on from before, some big earrings, some statement earrings, and I just feel like this is super cute. Yeah, I love this. Let me know what you guys think. Thank you so much for joining me for today's video. Also, let me know if you enjoyed this because I want to do more of these. I enjoy fashion. People are always asking me to do things like this. I never do. Um, so let me know what you think. Until the next video. Bye.